Hey, this is Brett, the Real Estate Cowboy, and right now we are at Stone Bridge Construction right now looking at new houses. This right here is their 3,100 square foot, five bed, three bath house, and I think that you guys are going to like what you see inside. First thing that you're going to notice coming in here is kind of these porch areas right here, and I mean, you can see, you know, the beautiful wood right here on the front, and just the nice covered area that, I mean, we as all in the Pacific Northwest know how valuable it is. Another fun thing here at uh, the Stone Bridge construction is the ring doorbells. These ring doorbells come standard with all of the models here. Another standard feature here at the Stone Bridge construction site is these Nest thermostats right here. Okay, what you're going to see here is you're going to come through the front door right here and you are going to be greeted just immediately right off the bat with the bathroom. Something you're going to love about this home is the space that you have here. I mean, you can see the open floor plan here and it is exquisite. All right, coming in the front door here, you can see we have uh, the bathroom over there. We have the downstairs bedroom and we have this beautiful staircase right here with some of the metal working um, coming over right here. I mean, it's a wonderful open floor plan. You can see we have uh, the gas fireplace right here. We have the luxury laminate floor right here. But then over here, we do have the kitchen, the quartz countertops. We have the, the five gas burner over there. And uh, you can see over here, we have the room for the dining table. You know, just moving along right here, uh, we do have a, a nice window set up right here. And then covered over right here, to the covered porch. And I mean, that here in the Pacific Northwest is gonna be something super nice uh, in the winter and the rainy months. I mean, you guys can see right here, you know, the, the covered porch area right there. And I mean, you can see the, 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 just the, the scale of this house right here, this five bed, you know, three bath house right here. It is, it's got size to it. And, you know, right over here, we can see that there is right there uh, a little gas spigot so uh, i'm guessing that would be great you know if you are going to try to put uh, a gas fireplace out here or you know some other kind of fixture out here you know lighting up top but i mean all in all uh, a great area for a barbecue um, some tables some chairs and uh, a nice place for the you and the family to, to hang out And in this model right here, you're going to see they give you this nice little office area right here, essentially in like your wet room coming out of the garage, which is great because, I mean, this does make for like a nice office if you are working from home or of a hybrid position. Another thing that I love here too is the coat racks and the little bench right here. You know, if you're trying to get your kids out the door in the morning, I mean, this right here is going to be a, a good area for, for their boots and, and putting their socks and shoes on. Outside of this right here, we do have a little closet right here for coats. All right, this right here is the garage on our five bed, three bath. And what you can see right here is it is a two car garage, but right over here, they are gonna give you workshop space. And I mean, this is huge. I mean, you can put, you know, your rolling cart, your benches, your cabinets over here. And I mean, not take away from your ability to pull the cars in and out. Another thing that's really nice right here is this door right here. So if you are putting your garbage cans right out here, you are going to be able just to open that door right there and kind of wheel them right down to the curb for the trash man. Right here, you can kind of see the size of the work area. I mean, it's pretty big. And uh, all these homes right here come with uh, the tankless water heater right there. So, I mean, once the hot water hits the faucet, I mean, you're going to have endless hot water for as long as you need. So if you want to take a six hour shower, feel free. Coming in here, you uh, have the pantry. And, I mean, just trying to give you uh, a little perspective on it right here. I mean, just how big this is. I mean, I'm about 
six foot tall and I mean you can see right here there's a little even bit more room so I mean these shelves have to be eight feet I mean and we have one two three four five of these shelves right here and another five right over here that are probably about three feet and so I mean if you're stocking up for doomsday you got a lot of canned goods here okay right here we are looking at the hall closet coming off the main entry and this thing is big and to give you a perspective how big it is well there i am i mean you can see here soon after i get the camera right here but um there's enough room for your christmas tree and a lot of the storage needs here i heard that this is actually called the harry potter closet if harry potter was a good boy and just had a little bit of an upgrade Okay, so what we're going to see on this house right here is we're going to see one, two, three, four, and a fifth one over here. All five bedrooms are all upstairs. And then you do also have the bonus room downstairs that you can use as an office, a guest bedroom, or even a six bedroom. Um, over here in the hall, we're going to see here soon uh, just how big it is in the bathroom over here. And then Closer over here, we are going to see the washroom. So having all five bedrooms up here, you're not going to have to trail laundry up and down the stairs. You are actually going to be able to take it right here and do all the loads with minimal travel. Here it is. I kind of pointed it out before, but this right here is uh, your washroom. And I mean, you're going to see right there. I mean, this one's got a, a sink in the, in the washroom right there your washer and dryer hookups and it also has um, some cabinetry up top for you kind of spinning around right here we have uh i guess what we call the the first bedroom and uh this looks like probably about one of the smallest bedrooms that we have here but um you can see right there it's got a, a nice closet i mean real nice closet doors too and I mean, the, the level of care that they, they put into these homes right here is, is nice. I mean, the window, um, this home right here has got nine foot ceilings in it, which is a great touch. I mean, just walking through this house right here, uh, it feels gigantic. I mean, it is gigantic, but um, it feels even bigger than how big it is. Just coming right over here, we're going to see some storage up here. So, I mean, you're going to have shelves right here for the towels and the blankets and really, I mean, honestly, anything that you want to put in there. Coming over here, we kind of saw just a second ago when I pointed, you know, this right here is uh, what I guess we can call the second bedroom. The two bedrooms behind me that you saw before, but then also that expansive hallway with uh, the double doors to the master. Sneaking over here, you can kind of see the entrance to the bathroom. But first, I wanted to go ahead and just kind of, you know, take a peek in over here at what we're going to go ahead and call the second bedroom. I mean, just a, a nice bedroom, nice bedroom probably for a younger kid or honestly anybody. I well, so here it is to kind of give you all a scale of just how big this room is right here. I'm kind of in the back corner and I got my tripod set up there in the doorway. And I mean, you can see this room right here is, I mean, big enough to honestly make anybody happy. I mean, you could even put uh, a, a couch and like a little lounge area over here with the bed here and dressers over there. I mean, this room is, is it is, it's big enough to, to make anybody happy. We are, uh, We are now in the, the second room over here on this side. And you can see this room right here is actually, I mean, it's pretty big too. If you have any older kids or, or kids that are going to need, you know, a little bit of that extra space. I mean, both of these rooms, they, they, they have it. This one's got the single window in it right here, but it does have this real nice closet right here. And what you're not really able to see is 
the closet kind of comes about this far into the wall right here and uh it does the same thing on the other side right here so i mean what you can see with that closet right there is actually uh just a, a fraction of uh what it actually does hold so so fun fact um about the the build here is essentially their hvac space is uh always housed indoors here and it's right behind me in this door right here and what they actually do is they use a solid door right here and they insulate it all the way around right here so i mean even whenever this thing's running um, you're not going to hear it i mean they did a great job making sure that this house is going to be peaceful and you're not going to hear you know the the noise from the hvac system now we're about to move to the master but I just kind of want to show you uh, essentially the way that this looked right here coming down this hall. Just for the reference, uh, we got the bathroom right here and the master behind me. So before we move into the master, we are going to go ahead and take a look at this bathroom. Coming into the bathroom here, um, we have the, the double sinks, I mean, which is nice for five bedrooms up here. You know, the double sinks is going to be a nice touch. Coming over here, you know, we have the toilet behind here. So I guess if anybody is using the toilet, you know, you're not going to just kill your, your sink area. Nice tub. I mean, especially if you got young kids who are going to be taking baths. I mean, that tub is going to handle it. You know, another thing that I really liked here about this house is um, right there, they put the, the fan essentially on this timer right here. So if you make a stinky here, you can just go ahead and select how stinky it was and do a five minute, 10 minute, 15 minute or 30 minute air out here. So this right here is the master and just uh, giving you exactly, I mean, how big this place is. I mean, so much room for like activities and like you can do like karate up here. But I mean, all in all, uh, if you have like a big bedroom set or anything else like that, I mean, this area right here is going to be able to do it for you. Um, yeah, I mean, I'm just taking it in right now, just the size of it. And back over here is the, the master bathroom and the master bathroom definitely fits the size of, of the room here. I'm just going to go ahead and just kind of grab it like this right here to show you. You know, this is uh, the, the big window that we have here in this. And then coming through the double doors right there. And then over here, right here, um, is the bathroom. So let's go check it out. So coming through here in the bathroom, they have, thank goodness, a double sink right here. So essentially, guys, we could probably get this space over here and then girls you could pretty much have all that right there for yourselves um but i mean this right here is it's big i mean it's really really big super nice soaking tub right there nice window that you can crack if you want to shower i mean the way that they match the the tiles together i mean i think it looks real nice it does toilet of course Back in here, coming over here, we have the closet. All right, so this right here is uh, the master closet. And you're probably thinking this thing's pretty big. Because you're right, it is pretty big. But come with me here. What you're going to see is uh, it gets even bigger. I mean, there's shelves over here for you. And uh, look, there's even more space over here to give you uh, a 360 view or as R. Kelly would say, trapped in a closet. Coming over here like that. See top and bottom rails right there. All the shelving right there. And then just to kind of go through the, the whole upstairs one last time. We're going to go ahead and 
pan through everything. Oh, there's the ring light. And just the size, the size of this place. So master right there, bathroom right there, and over. Right there, beach back, smaller bedroom there on the left, bigger one on the right that we showed. Right here, probably the smallest bedroom, but I mean, still, it's got the size that you're gonna need for anybody. Closet right there, over here, the fifth bedroom. And of course, the laundry room up here. Okay, coming on down the stairs. Nice window, nice picture. Feels great. Kind of see over there again. You know, your living area over there on the right with the fireplace. That big open kitchen, big open floor plan. And of course, uh, your dining room table over there. And then. Where is it? Back in there. You can kind of see that um, extra bonus space that they gave you for like a desk or a, maybe a little bit of a work from home area or something else that you want. Coming on down through here, they're using that as a uh, essentially an office right now. I mean, that's what you could use it for also. Or you could essentially kind of try to use that for a... Uh, a six bedroom. I mean, if you wanted it to, but it's coming around here. Give them one final look through the house here for you all. Yep, big three foot doors, big three foot doors, bathroom on the left, bonus room on the right, Harry Potter's closet right there. Sneaking around, you can see right there where uh, you could do a little entertaining and barbecuing. Real nice yard. Once again, that huge wet room back there with that office counter space. Coming over here to that big, big, big doomsday pantry right there. And uh, that about does it.